when I decided uh, I wanted to use medical marijuana to treat my brain tumour, I was aware that I was doing something illegal in this country. Quite frankly, when you're facing your death, all of that goes out the window. On diagnosis, you are told as a patient that they cannot save your life. They are doing this to perhaps give you 18 months. So the debunking operation would be followed six weeks later, which is what happened to me by an intensive course of six weeks of radiation. I've worn an original 1940s for you this morning. <laughs> Very nice. Well, you know, I like to make an effort. <laughs> and Temozolomide, which is a type of chemo, the only type that gets into the blood-brain barrier. It's my hair is just coming out. And it just sucks. You can literally but just pull it out. We shouldn't be doing this, but it's going to come out anyway. This is what we're left with. Post six weeks of radiation and chemotherapy. I think I've put my body through the most traumatic thing you could possibly put your body through after having that operated out and then to be left with this for up to five months now I think I'll be left with that. It's like nothing you can ever explain to anybody I think. The tumour unfortunately grew back within probably weeks of having the treatment which was pretty shocking. It's been predicted that I have a lifespan of between 18 months and 5 years. I really don't want to die. I want to have a life. But we'll just have to see what happens. I decided to stop taking their treatment. I refused chemo. They wanted me to take another 6 months and another 6 months. Um, as soon as they told me it had failed, I didn't see the point in putting that in my body. So I started to investigate and I found a YouTube film of a man in America that had treated a baby with cannabis oil. And as soon as I saw it, it was like a light bulb. That is what's going to save my life. I set about finding the right person to treat me in America. A 72 year old, I call him the wizard because he really is. Uh, he was very spiritual with the plant and we decided that I needed the top amount he'd ever administered to anybody. Once I started administering the cannabis oil, I started to feel better almost immediately. By December, of that year when I should have by all uh, terms been dead, I got the best news of my life. I have had my MRI and diddly diddly, newsflash, cannabis kills cancer. <laughs> I have cured my cancer with cannabis. God bless the God of cannabis. We love you. At that point, I was told that I was the only patient in the history that they knew of an astrocytoma that had gone away and successfully shrunk this incurable tumor. The tumor had shrunk down to just scar tissue. I am the first human being to do this successfully that we know of. I made an agreement with myself that if I did manage to do this and save my life, that I would spend the rest of my life trying to campaign to get this noticed. The most painful thing for me is every time I go in and have my MRI, that I see all the other patients and I can hardly talk about it um, because they're bald, they're slumped, they're being fed by the person next to them. Um, and to sit there and know that you could give them a medicine that 
wouldn't do any of those things to them, and I have experienced all of this, is heartbreaking every time I go in there. Do I believe that the cannabis is the thing that saved my life, not a placebo? Of course I do, I, absolutely 100%. And if uh, the doctors were asked, they would have to agree with that. I take cannabis all day long, every day, for the last three years, and I will do for the rest of my life. If I didn't, my tumor would grow back and kill me. So I have a bomb in my head and I need to take this medicine and I need the doctors to hurry up and let me have this without being a criminal or having to go through what I have to to save my life because nobody should have to go through that, surely. To the glass of the green, magical, lovely, delicious tincture that makes you well. We give thanks and say cheers to this beautiful plant.